peak of the upcoming Nothing But Discussion Studio Challenge. My brother still looking for Jesus. That's what they say. Let me see. Let me read what you're trying to say. Let me read what you're trying to say. I'm just saying, dial it. I think you should say, jump out the roof like a nigga be dying. Now niggas writing for me, though. <laughs> I gotta stay true. I told my niggas, I was like, I never in my life a nigga right for me shoot me. So, like, Are you right if that happened, then. <laughs> nah, then all white ones there, niggas gonna buy it. Smoking on beers, yeah, now my eyes red. I don't like it. You like one more. I don't like it, bro. You gonna put that? Niggas gonna buy it. Y'all can't say that shit, huh? Don't try to write it. Like, you was better when you was freestyling. Like, that first shit was way harder. <laughs> I said that shit last time. I saw that shit last time. Demon shit. Talk that street demon shit. Tell me how I'm feeling, nigga. I'm feeling like. Oh, you whoa, just heard what you just said. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What are we doing? What are we doing? What are we doing? What are we doing? Nothing with him. So hot, bro. I had to go, goddamn, get the whole damn studio, bro. I got me my little piano, do, 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 baby shark, mic, computer. Spent like racks on that shit just to let these niggas know how much I hate snitches, bro. So I had to make some songs. I was hoping that you could uh, get on it with me, even though you be telling sometimes. I do be snitching, nigga, but I do it for the one time, bro. Too slime. Gonna draw the album and I say he too slime. We heard his name? Yep. Yes, sir, man. We back with another episode, man. You know another. what's going on. If you tapped in right now, thank y'all for listening, tap, man. Tap, tap, tap in, as the weedy would say. No, I thought you about to hit him with the nav. Uh, what is that one? Tap, 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 tap. 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 Uh, something, something, get it. Tap, rap, tap, rap, tap. Rap. If y'all see us right now, y'all see we got a special guest today. Uh, we we got Young, young Mayo in the What's building, man. man. Yes, sir. Young Measy, man. Yes, say. sir. How you feeling? How you feeling, man? I feel great, man. Yeah. How y'all feeling? Y'all feel I'm good? feeling like beautiful, gorgeous. I'm gorgeous. feeling like a million bucks. <laughs> feeling like buying this a brand new truck. But nah, two I years. I say some brand new chucks. Two years ago, today to actually. To this day. <laughs> <laughs> to this day. We had Mayo on the young pod Measy. two years ago. Yes, sir. When he was and when back when we was sharing mics. Yeah, go back and you know crazy. what? We gotta put the like jump right above us. Me and Nate was sharing a mic, bro. Right above us right now. If you're on YouTube, you're gonna go ahead and click on that episode that right now at this moment. Oh, hell That's problems. back when we was sharing mics. Month, That's back when we had the I was having the wait, what? What I miss? <laughs> no, move on. Move on. Uh, okay. <laughs> That's back when I had to edit your eyes, remember? Oh yeah, man. Yeah. Edit your eyes. Lazy. What do you mean? Yeah. <laughs> oh, okay. I, yeah. Buffalo soldier. <laughs> Gun like he's like, he's like, bro, my eyes is red, bro. <laughs> well, we back in this thing. If you listening right now, man, um, shout out to everybody on Apple Podcast, Spotify. Uh, we appreciate y'all tapping in every week. Y'all turned us up on that last episode. Yeah, did turn us y'all up. know we still got the mukbang coming. You know what I'm saying? Bang. We about to go crazy, but let's get it started off right. Yes, sir. Why this fool? Y'all thought I was about to drop. Y'all thought I was about to drop. We in the building, man. Episode 79, man. We up in this building. Let's go. Like Sylvester. Sylvester. Spotify, Apple Podcasts. All y'all clap it up for us right now, man. Give us, give us a round of applause real quick, man. This round of applause. We in this game, man. Look at the producer. <laughs> look at him go, guys. Just look at him go. That's what happens when you add a little production to the show. But uh, like we said, we got I a special guest a today, uh, Young Measy in the building, man. So yes, he got an Young album. When, when the album coming? Seven twenty two, man. Seven twenty two. He said, "You know what it do." July twenty second. July. If you ain't in, you a bitch. I'm just, oh, I'm just damn. saying. Damn. If you ain't listening, I I'm coming. Listen. I'm coming like that. If you ain't listening, you a bitch. That's damn, just how it is. Bro, why is so aggressive? Now that's, that's how it is, man. Yeah, ask, listen, I've been trying to figure it out. Listen, why? What, what's the aggression? So listen, so listen. This is why I'm yeah, aggressive. Because then what if they be like, oh, now you're going to, what if you just mm-hmm. so listen, saying up. that? You know so what I'm saying? Up. So hold up. He's like, damn. Manager. Listen. Like, I'm a bitch now? Because I just ain't want to listen. Hell, hell yeah. Damn. Okay, explain the, explain so the aggression, okay, okay, okay. the pain. So All that listen, pain. I get whole So Biz, man, you, Biz, you've been in the music game for a minute too, man. Yeah. You, are, you already know how it goes. Yeah, y'all man. season. It's, it's yeah. already hard enough to get Old like Bay season salt. <laughs> <laughs> All that salt pepper. But nah, it's already hard enough, man. I mean, it's already hard enough trying to get like the support and shit, even in your own city, man. Like, I, like in my experience, I've always had better luck getting it, getting the love from like outside of uh and the M for real, like. When I was going to L.A., like, I was tapping in with hella artists over there. Mm. Next thing you know, I'm getting, uh, you know, people over in L.A. listening to my shit. My boy went down to Florida. Next thing you know, I got people down in Florida showing me love. 
Manassas, man, it's like I almost have to pull teeth trying to get that shit, man. So the reason I'm aggressive with it is because that this project, man, it, I put so much fucking work, blood, sweat, and tears into this shit, man. I've been working on this shit for damn near a year now. Like, like I, I done changed, like, ha- shit. Let's say I started off with 20 songs. I cut it in half. Then those 10 songs I had, I said, nah, I don't want eight of them. I'm going to replace it with these eight. Like, I've been very particular. So you took your, you took your time with it. You really doing three man weave with his music. Like, bro, I'm trying to like mm. if this is an out like I've dropped tapes, bro, and tapes are just like I can crank those out in uh, you know a month or two's time. I can just make ten songs real quick. Boom, there's a tape. You know what I mean? But an album, bro, like I feel like especially when it's an album, like it's different, man. Like, like no, can you, we like hold up? Like you hear you hear someone like like Nudie, right? Like you you like yeah. Young Nudie, right? Yeah. Young Nudie drop a mixtape. That shit mid, you be you probably be like, all right, well it's just a tape, like whatever. But an album, bro, think about how much anticipation goes into an album, like a Drake album, a fucking nudie album. Albums in general, man, like that's your chance as an artist to like really shine, to like really show what you're like made of for real. Okay. Like, like, like I said, a tape, like I treat those like singles, bro. Like, so this is your time. So you're saying you you put all shine. into it and you want bro, everybody like, I ain't to drop see a music video in like shoot like f- four years, like. Like, I'm trying to, like, especially with everything going on in my personal life, like, I really got time now to, like, really lock down in this shit and, like, you know, take my time with it um, and pursue it. One thing I, I would say about the support in the Manassas is that what one thing that I kind of learned is that you kind of have to, like, get out there and be, like, in niggas' faces. Like, like them niggas, like, like I always mention them, them little life niggas always, that they always show me hella love. But it's, like, still, like, when I was going out and doing them shows, like... <clears throat> I would tap in like well first they were doing shows in like Arlington, Alexandria, like I was doing those shows out there with them. And then it's like when we all like tapped in with each other, we all performing and shit, like niggas eventually like fuck with you and it's like you just if niggas is just keeping it cool, like and niggas notice like your shit is actually quality, like they'll tap in. So it's like as far as like with that shit, I feel like because Nasir was, like, me and Nasir, like, when we had just did our little, like, our album. Vlog coming soon. Yeah, our vlog. Coming soon. Nasir was, like, you know, he's Nasir was, like, he's better with networking online and, like, working that, like, working the Instagram and, like, no, social No, I'm media. good either or. But, like, but then, like, you, you gave it, like, you was, like, you, but you said you're, like, you're good like that. But then you said I'm better. I'm, like, more so me. I'm better than doing that. Than online. Yeah, yeah I yeah, noticed yeah, that. Yeah, you're yeah. better at networking in person than yeah, online. Like, <laughs> but I kind of. When you, when, you, when you in Nick's face and you keeping it genuine, it's it's easier for somebody to want to tap in with yeah. you. Yeah, so I'm a talker online. though, so I can do it like yeah, yeah, online yeah, in person. You so I can chop up a, yeah. a conversation real good. But I want to get into what Nate was saying a little bit. So you saying in the city, it's easier for you to get support outside the city than where you're from. That's always been the fact. That's yeah, always man, the case for everybody. Like, but why like is that the case? Dudes be trying to be Hollywood, man. Yeah. You know, like like I got a persona with my music shit. I mean, everybody does. Like. You have Can I to tell the mic, please? Um, my bad. Everybody has a persona with this music shit, man. I mean, you kind of have to, right? So, I mean, and that, that's just like your presence, right? Like that's your, like your 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 stage act. What would you say your persona but, is? I don't think. I mean, I feel like my persona, like I mean, you guys know me outside of the music shit. Like I'm a dad. Like, you know, I got a full time job. Like I be, you know, I got a family to take care of. So there's that side of my life. But this side of my life, I feel like is who I am. Like as as a singular person. You know what I mean? Like. Like when I'm when I'm the family man, like that's that's yeah, it's still me, but, but it's not young Meezy. But it's not, I, well, yeah, lo, yeah, you right about that. But at the same time, like I'm sense. not thinking about myself in that moment. Like I'm yeah. thinking about what I got to do, put on for my kids. Like mm. put put food oh, put it. food in their tummy, put a roof over the head. Like that's the type of time I'm on with them. But when I have this, like I think about them and this shit too. But that's more so on like if I make it, like I know they're good. Like they're good. Their kids are good. Like. That's that's what I'm trying to pursue on this side of it. So I feel like I almost have to carry myself like, I mean, just not cocky, but I got to be confident with it, like a little bit of swag. You know what I mean? Like, like so you say so your persona you say is like is cocky or like what? Is it, you got yeah, I mean, swag. I guess chip on your shoulder. Yeah, yeah I mean, like the bitch, cool like the cool like white boy. On, bro, you a like, bitch if you don't listen to the project. You got chip uh, on his shoulder. He do sound you like you know got chip on the shoulder. You do sound like you I got do, chip on your shoulder. Because listen, yeah. man, I've been I've been slept on for hella long, and that's and that's a lot because I haven't been consistent. With it, and again, that's with some personal shit I got going on. But now that some of that personal shit is fading out, I can really start focusing and like, you know, getting cranking. Like I've been in the studio. Shout out to the fridge, man. If you ain't tapped into the fridge, you also a bitch. But if you ain't, Damn, he's like, sending out shots. Yeah, everybody. Fa fa. 
But but okay, but what Biz fridge. said before, yeah. what would you say in the beginning? We say your bitch first time. He was saying, okay, so if you saying one that like you were consistent at one point, but things caused the things to become inconsistent. But now you're back. You back on the scene being consistent. Oh yeah, and I ain't going Biz, away. And Biz is saying that you might scare the people off by saying they a bitch, bitch if they don't listen. Do you feel like they really are bitches for not listening, or you said like the consistency nah, is new? Love. I'm just playing. But at the same time, hold up. But at the same time, okay, I do mean that in a, in a sense, in a sense. I'm just feeling how you feel. In you can say whatever you want to say. No, it's nothing but discussion. No, I'm being, I'm being honest. <laughs> Be honest, <laughs> as fuck, as fuck. I'm being honest. Like I ain't that mean, guys. You know I'm not that mean. No, I'm just, I'm trying to hear you. I mean, your thoughts. I'm, I'm, looking we picking, I'm, like, I'm picking your brain right for now. For the first, first, for the person who's watching this and who don't know who Young Meezy is, and then they like, like who the it, fuck it, this dude talking you, to? And then it's like, yeah, I'm a bitch now. <laughs> like I don't know what the fridge is. Either. I'm a bitch. Like damn, I don't even want to listen to your shit. Now I'm a double nah. bitch. <laughs> or they might be intrigued and be like, well, why he call me a bitch? His shit gotta be. Yeah, you got them niggas. I'm not a bitch. I'm a bitch right now. So the reason I feel that way is because. Like, like I feel like I'm super like slept on. Like I mean, yeah. I mean every artist does, but at the same time, like I've been around like artists that I mean, like you can tell when someone just don't have it, bro. Like <laughs> I mean, I mean let's be honest. Like you can tell when someone don't have Say, it. Add a name to it. I ain't gonna do that. Oh, okay, but that that's you that's was activated. Many, I was trying to see how activated you is. I'm. I I'm mean, when, it. The, when the shades come on, I'm activated. But okay, okay. I ain't, I ain't that activated. You're gonna have to put some liquor in me or something. Oh, uh, uh, you should have had the tea. You should have had the tea. Handy. But now nah, you got y'all gotta do y'all thing after this. Yeah, we still have it. But go ahead, go ahead, Nate. <laughs> go ahead, go ahead, Nate. But I feel like you know, being that I'm slept on, like there, I gotta get people's attention in one way or another. And if that's me being cocky. Me me carrying myself a certain way, I'm going to do that. But I'm going to still be genuine. Like, I ain't going to, like, I will send one name out. Hey, Cash Bentley, if you watching this. Oh. Uh, go ahead. Hey, Cash Bentley, if you watching this, where are your friends at, man? Where are your friends at? I'm still with my real ones, and we coming up together. <laughs> All your friends, they done found out who you are, bro. I ain't even mad about the shit that happened. Turn them up. I ain't even mad about that shit what happened. That's in the past, bro. Nah, he, he's still know. mad. That's what he's saying. Nah, I ain't mad about that shit. Oh, he's not. That bony ass money you try to finesse off me. Oh, but hey, it's all it's all good, bro. I hope you good. <laughs> Just know that I'm really wait, good. Wait, you wait, 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 wait. I hope you good. Easy, easy, easy. It started off with "fuck you, a bitch," and he's in it like, "I, I hope, hope you good." good. <laughs> so which, you know what? I know I'm better. Um. He's he standing on that. He's he he standing on that. He set up for himself. He threw it off the Lynch backboard. Niggas come on the pod to send shots. It seemed like, let's go. We turning up today. That nigga threw it off the backboard. Ooh, he already already started to get off his chest. We don't need to get off his chest now. He getting it off right now. Yeah, he, he early. All right, well, let's get back to what we hear at hand. The project, what is it? What's project. it around? Like, what's it around? Yeah, what's what's it centered so like, around? Because we, we, we've, we've heard the singing sad boy young man we heard turning up mm. young male and these is both auto tune young male you seem like you also, dirt me right on. now oh, oh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> we also heard we rarely do hear no tune mm. easy so you saying what i'm saying no where's tune no auto easy yeah where's no tune no easy? auto easy i like no tune i like no auto i like no tune it's on there uh but you getting a Ooh, lot you getting a lot of you, no tune easy you getting a lot of genres out of me on this one man i got country some, i got some rock shit on there mm. um really trying yelling? to really trying to explore my range some man. niggas snort the lines like, too yeah like some what? that they can snort their lines too like growl yell uh it's like blink 182 vibes you know ah, like this is the I type of shit i grew up that listening one. to i liked it Okay, that's but what is your bag, Loki? I like rock shit. Bro, it was on the Madden playlist, uh, on the Madden shit. Niggas, you know, have, you, was, you know you was singing the rock. Have y'all ever been to a rock show with Biz? This nigga be lit. <laughs> this nigga be front row in the mosh pits, jumping with no, him. First no time more I went. Mosh pits for me. <laughs> no <more> mosh pits for me. <laughs> I'm scared. I wish we had that video. Then they know why. I'm scared. <laughs> Wait, okay, so what? So you, so you got rock, you got rap, you got no auto, you got arm biz. R&B? You know, it really R&B all depends on what the song, like, what I'm bringing in with that song. All the songs are kind of circled around, like, what I got going on in my personal life. Like, mm, I ain't... It's a story. It, in a way. Like, I, it just be, like, whatever I was feeling that day, that's what I made music about. Mm. Um, but, like, I so got... So, what's the project called, though? Pressure. Oh, pressure. pressure. One word. Pressure. Uh, yeah, because you a bitch if you don't listen to Pressure. All right, well, you got a main pressure. single on it that we could just get in, play real quick. What's Ooh. the name of it before we play it? Never coming back. This, right. is, this is where my man's shout out BBO Flex, man. 
This Child is Flex. Never Coming Flex, Flex, Back man. by Young Measy featuring BBL Flex. We're going to yeah. give y'all a little snippet of it. Cra, cra, cra. This is a little sad boy, Measy. I ain't going to lie. But I do like this. Trying to make us cry? Let's see. Let's see how we feeling, man. Let's see the temperature we coming out with. Young Measy back on the scene, man. Cra, cra. Bentley, you know what it is with him. Damn long. Okay, Flex, I was trying to have your back. I was trying to have your back. Hey, I've been gone for two damn long. Spend it, take it, run it back. Girl, you miss it. And it's because you was going. Gave you my heart and you dragged it in the mud. Nothing's going to fix it, not even the drug. All I ever really wanted was your love. Show me your true colors, baby, this is dope. And you got to know how I really feel about you, girl. I'll keep it real with you. Ain't going to lie, I was fucking with you. But you stand me. Young Music coming out July 22nd, man. Full album. What's the name of the album again? Pressure. 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 Putting that pressure, pressure on you. And pressure. you see he coming with pressure on the pot. Yeah. Pressure on the pot. Pressure everywhere, man. Yeah, the explanation behind the people. name, man. Like, yeah, how, not, what is Young Measy? What is yeah, Young Mayo all about? Yeah, so, like, that's a good I question. Know, I know that you, at one point, since I'm your man, you was going through that at one point. You said, man, should I change my name? Should I change my name? Ah, 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 ah. I said, hey. Well, how long is he had the name? Since high like school, bro. Since like 2014, mm. he's bro. been young male before. I nah, that's kept. That's kept. My, my fault. I was about to lie. We about to, my, my, to my lie, fault. nigga. Oh, I was about to say he was young male before I was biz, but no, I got nah. biz in middle school. Yeah. Oh, okay. Nah, yeah, you yeah, been biz, bro. I been biz, man. That's biz. Um, but young male, I always thought that I was like, I was like, damn, he got like a like a like a cool like name because he white. Yeah, man. <laughs> mayonnaise is white, but yeah. it was like a joke at first, though. It was a joke at first. <laughs> he said mayonnaise lie. is white. So listen, <laughs> so listen. Me and Lorenzo, me and my shout out Lozo, man. Oh uh, yeah, Lozo, uh, hey, friend me of the Lozo, pod. Yeah, them niggas started, friend of the show. Uh, oh yeah, you gotta tell how that shit started out. Yeah, man. man I we forgot about that fucking shit. Fucking, and we was in my hmm? fucking. Uh, <laughs> What? <laughs> it sounded crazy, but go ahead, my boy. Nah, the rap <laughs> shit, the rap <laughs> shit. And y'all, see, <laughs> I got, and y'all see, I got my pride shirt on I, today, I, man. I, and I got my pride shirt on, bro. He Shout out pri- to the gays today, man. We doing it. Biz slowly. Is you know I'm worried, y'all. We doing it. Y'all know Mr. Beast, man. <laughs> and slowly it just changed. I and it started. It started with shout out the gays two years ago. Go back and listen to the episodes. And it's, now, it's and now he got the merch. It's probably. I've been had this. At, by you the got way. the merch, y'all. I've been had. But back it. to Young Measy. Why you got the name? He got the merch though. I have a beautiful black queen. In Texas right now, I love you, baby. Hey, but another word about June, real quick. I don't know when this pod gonna drop, but June's Men's Mental Health Aware Month. Make sure to check on your homies. That's we giving all the shout outs, everything. Yeah. <laughs> we shout out everything. Yeah. Wait, it's, mental, it's to, men's mental. Well, uh, it's men's mental. Uh, it's it. men's mental awareness. You didn't know, brother? No. Well, let me, let me, yeah, let's man. update you. Update yeah, me. Let's, yeah, let's, let's why? Update why we gotta like be? Why back. we gotta be aware of men's mental health? Because, Met- brother, sometimes we go through some shit. Think about it and like this. Nate, you're not aware of nobody's mental health. We we can't Me? express it. You said you're you not worried about always, you're not worried about Bentley. You can't say that, nigga. He always posted on the line. He's not worried about Bentley. Bentley. Mental health. He said fuck nah. his mental. Yeah, he the only man that's, that he say <laughs> fuck that shit. Nah. <laughs> that nigga don't care about his mental. He fucked because he fucked with his mental first. Yeah, that's why <laughs> I say fuck that nigga. Anyway. Okay. But why is it Ms. Mental Health Awareness Month though? When did when but did I this come around? When did this come around? It's the it's the month of June, bro. So listen, like I thought this was June. So team, men's but, men's mental health is it's very everything. is very put aside because as a man, you're taught to just you know come like you grow up and like shit happens, whatever you get past it, you're a man. Like men don't men don't learn that it's okay to go seek help sometimes. Like now nah, you a bitch if you go get therapy for a fro. Look at this nigga. I'm yes. not smiling. <laughs> guess, I, guess I'm a bitch. <laughs> guess I'm a bitch. Damn. I'm not smiling. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> nah, but for uh, I, this is like one of these random months that popped up, like uh, Latino month in October. <laughs> that just just popped up what? out of nowhere. I feel like the the women's month. That joint, right? Maybe they gave it because Father's Day is this month. Can too? we find out how many national holidays there are in June? Like in June, June popping low key. Mm-hmm. What y'all doing for Juneteenth? Um, Work chicken. Chicken, but you gonna work on Juneteenth? <laughs> oh yeah, you have to. You work to, bro. What you doing? We uh hanging out at the crib, eating good. Mm. Oh y'all got good. some lined up? Nah, I'm just cat. I'm just talking. See, black people don't give a fuck about Juneteenth, bro. Bro, what you what y'all doing? I come over here. We gonna do it up. 
We could do something. Hey, I'm supposed to link with my grandma first, but then we can link. Oh, we can link. House. Yeah, we go over there. We can link up. Yeah, Let's we'll make something happen. Going. Get some fireworks. Let's start shooting fireworks with Juneteenth, bro. Shooting fireworks with Juneteenth? Yes. Cause it's because that's all 4th of July. That's all 4th of July. We got to treat it as such. Yeah, man. They got a movie coming out called The Black, and then they trying to make like Juneteenth movie type shit. Yeah, I was actually helping you them direct it. The but you know, it is not in the Matrix no more. Actually, that actually kind of, that's kind of a transition to the topic. So, if y'all didn't know, over the past week, Home Depot women turned out to be fine as hell. So this one girl go viral, and she go viral for her look. She look good. It's another Alex from Target. Remember, if y'all remember in 2014, that white boy that was working at Target, and they took a picture of him, and it was like, Alex from Target. And he was on Ellen and all that. You don't remember that? Yes, I do. Oh, you do. Okay, why you side then? It's so stupid. What? Pretty privilege? I guess that's what it was. Handsome. I wish I had pretty privilege. Shit. My life would be so much better. What? what? (laughs) Nah, you have, what is it? Funny privilege? Is that a thing? Since you're the funny nigga that everybody want to rock with you. Yeah, oh, yeah I uh, guess. In a way. I guess. Yeah. In a way, a little bit. But yeah, pretty privilege is what happened to this girl from That's Home Depot. Girls too, funny to privilege. the fact. Yeah, the girls do like to laugh. But if you look good, you funny, and you got that, it's, it's over. But you could do that as an ugly nigga, too. Yeah, but then she's scared, though. She's going to laugh, but she's going to be like, eh. <laughs> <laughs> Is she? <laughs> is she? <laughs> but so the girl she from Home Depot went viral ugly. for her selfie. <laughs> In the mirror, she's like in a Home Depot bathroom. Took a picture on it. Everybody on her body going crazy. Even Shaq, the Diesel, was trying to drop that Diesel. Barbecue chicken. Was trying. To, <laughs> he was trying to barbecue some he, chicken. He was trying to barbecue some chicken. You right. And he slid in her DM. She gonna screenshot it and show it. But there's a topic at hand hey. that that I feel like got ignored about this that I found out about like last night. So she's going viral for how good she looks, right? So she has all these opportunities coming her way. So men on the internet are like. It's nice to see a woman that's working a job and don't got her only fans. Like, I was like, okay, all right. Then the women on the internet are like, girl, you need to quit this job and make only fans. And people were literally, like, taking both sides serious. I think my opinion is everybody shut up. But you got, okay, so look, Miss Be Nasty, all the niggas, freak niggas that just tuned in extra hard, you freaky as hell. Uh, she said, now she can do what she wants. This doesn't negate from her beauty. I just think... Right now, yeah, I just don't think she knows what sex work is. So a little bit of context: they were really trying to convince her to make her OnlyFans. Like they, they were like women that were like she's lame as hell. How do y'all nothing. feel? How do y'all feel about this generation being open to like hoeing? That's what we're gonna get to right. Let me finish this jump real quick. So she says, so they're trying to really force her to do it, and then she's like, I just don't think she knows what sex work is. It's a blanket term for everything, from financial domination to prostitution. Full service sex work is the proper term, and everything between, not just OnlyFans porn. Then she also the last thing she said, it's sex work who never get uh, it's sex workers who never get naked or ever fuck, but are still very much sex workers ca- uh, catering to certain fetishes and fetishes do what pe- uh, get people off. So they're trying to really convince this girl who just want to work, who just and a doctor, she just want to work, go to Home Depot, tell them all three is where the uh, the paint buckets are. They saying nah, you lame as hell for that. Now, in y'all opinion, if that's somebody you know, a friend, whatever, how do y'all take that? Good for her for not doing that shit, man. I think, I mean, let's be honest, bro. The internet, man, is flooded with that shit. And you know what? Dudes are stupid enough to go pay for that shit on the internet. Guys, if you paying for porn, you stupid as hell. You know how much free porn there is on the internet? But there might be a real bad one who but got something behind the paywall. Always, There's real bad not, porn stars. It's not, it's but not they, always porn, though. It could be the feet shit, too. They be doing that shit. That's still sex this, work. I saw this one white girl who bought her mama a brand new car because she was uploading her mama feet on this like website, and she saved up all that money and mm. bought her a new car. And the mama so you're saying like, she should do that, too, then? She, I mean, I'm not saying she should do that. I'm just saying there's not, just not only porn on. That's so. That's what Miss Be Nasty was saying too. That she don't gotta get butt, but uh, bucket naked. I don't care what she do. She could do whatever she want. It, it just it, it. She what she wants to do is work at Home Depot. That's what she. That's what she tweeted, and she said she'll never make OnlyFans. Yeah, yeah me so personally, like, bro. Like I don't I, care what she do. It yeah. don't matter to me. I like, just, do it up. What you want to do? You want to be fine on OnlyFans or you want to be fine at the Home Depot? Like, but what do you think about everybody trying to convince her to do it? They're weird. Like, why it's do you weirdos. care so yeah. much? Like, if, if you care so much, you, you do it, bro. Like, mm. or maybe you don't feel like, or why are you trying to live through her? Like, or why, like, why are you trying to make, like, li- do your choices through her? Like, I it's think it's just, I think OnlyFans craze has just gotten now. Yeah. I think we see it, it's too crazy now because before it's like. Look, it's like it's like a lane over here. So if you're a shorty and you see a bag for it, you go for it. You do whatever you do, right? But then then you see niggas that want to pay for it. All right, that's your lane over here. You do what you want to do. 
But then when y'all take y'all lane and then try to put it in everybody else's lane and then try to be like, shorty, you need to get bucket naked right now. You could be making this much money. You could do this. You could move your mom on this. Why are you dumb as hell? You don't want to do this? And she say no. And everybody attacking her for it. Y'all look crazy to me. And I might be the odd man out on this one. But y'all niggas look crazy. But it's like, what no, if I she agree. did that shit? And then, right? I'm like, or like, because like, since people have that sort of like, of like, of opinion towards people, like, they can have that p- opinion towards like a regular person. She, and at what the opinion? end of the day, what like, now she's a regular person, but now she's like kind of like known. Yeah. yeah but like, since like, you could, she, they could do it to somebody else. And somebody else might really might start thinking about it and do it, like, get in their brain. And then they actually start it up. Like, what if they shit fail? Now they just naked for no reason online, as yeah. we've seen before. There's a lot of OnlyFans models that you see more and more in your area, too. And uh, if, I don't, I don't if, know. if y'all just, uh, I'm not saying, like, go behind the paywall, but if y'all have ever clicked on, like, they link just to see how many, what they oh, numbers do. Oh, yeah. Their numbers do, like, three, maybe two, maybe three. And it's like, you bucket naked right now for three viewers. It's crazy, man. You know what I'm saying? Crazy, like everybody don't find that success. success. If you find the success, I'm about to say it's all them success like stories, bro. That get in their head. Just like YouTubers, like, just like podcasters, yeah. just like any field music. music it's gonna be the ones, but at least them niggas ain't that's, bucket but niggas. That's, that's <laughs> way more of a risk. <laughs> unless you don't care. Unless you don't care, it's yeah. way more of a risk. Yeah. Well, like y'all heard about the little boy who got bullied because his mama was naked Ooh. on OnlyFans. Sebastian. No, 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 not 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 the not, not, it was another one. Shit, he was crying and stuff, and he was thinking Ooh. about killing himself. That's why they need to stop doing that shit, bro. But what about the people that say you need to tell your kids to stop being mean? Mm. What you say you for that? You can't stop kids from bullying. What? But if kids everybody are gonna, kids are mean as shit, bro. If everybody me, at home, if everybody at home raised their kids to not be mean and accept porn stars and OnlyFans and trans. Look, you're living. That's in a perfect world, bro. You're living in a perfect world right now. Kids are assholes. That's just how it is. Yeah. I got two of them, bro. I know they assholes, but I mean, my kids are nice. They ain't so your kids make fun time? of. So your kids make fun of OnlyFans uh, sons. Probably. I'll put it to you this way: I, if if I grew up in this era, right, and I was thirteen, fourteen years I'm old, frying. Bro, I'm frying your way, hey, bro. Your mom butt naked online hey. right here, bro. Hey. Oh, wait, if hey, she, wait, do they have to say something to you? Be like, be like hey. if, unless you try to violate me, like, oh, you try to get I'm warranted. It sounds like y'all saying y'all doing this. I'm like, warranted. It's gonna lead to a lot I'm of like, ass whoopings. Like, yeah, it's gonna real. all these fights is gonna happen, bro. Yeah. Niggas gonna be fighting over there. Yeah, moms. like if, uh, I think it's, it's because already, bro, people don't got no shame. Bro, you remember how it was back in the day when niggas used to talk about your mom? You know how mad you used to get. I ain't never really had. I'm be honest with you. I never really had serious niggas talk bro, about. Bro, there's this one nigga who used to tro- back when trolling. I didn't know what trolling was, bro. I was a kid. Niggas was trolling me. Now I think about it. Mm. I be getting hot. Blah, 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 blah. Your mom. Blah, 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 blah. Your mom. I used to get hot, bro. He, all he was saying is your mom. Like, ah, like, nigga, like, I just wanted to, like, fight that nigga, but I'm not finna do I'm not finna get in trouble, but, like, I just wanted to take off on that nigga. Like, you just kept saying, like, they was like, bro, just relax, bro. Just chill, bro. Like, is that the worst you ever got trolled? Um, Cause that sound pretty crazy. All that nigga said was your mom. You used you, you, like, ah. bro. I was a kid. This is my feelings. <laughs> <laughs> you know how but, kids get. But that's up. like the oldest book joke in the book. Like even when I first heard that junk, I was like I, the year I, mom I my junk. Mom, bro. I don't want nobody talking about her, bro. Don't. Talk I about think her. the worst I got trolled was when a nigga tricked me to do the jerk. <laughs> what? Like hey, you know the jerk? Wait, yo, the jerk? Hey, yo, the jerk? I, I know, I'm not talking about. I'm not talking about pause way. But how did how did you get tricked into doing a dance? So I was like, the nigga was like, you gotta take ten steps forward. Oh yeah, <laughs> yeah, it is. Take <laughs> ten steps backwards, and then like he was like this. Then you gotta do this. Charlie Brown. You gotta, you gotta Charlie do this Brown. <laughs> and then like I went to a party. And then I, it was like, yeah, Jack. I know. Yeah, Jack. <laughs> and I took boy, 10 steps back, forward. Charlie Brown. <laughs> 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 yeah. They was like, this is not, this is not the motherfucking cha cha song. But nigga. then I got tricked another time because I was doing the Dougie. I was hitting my Dougie. He's like, nah, he supposed to hit your jump like this. He's supposed to like this. And oh, I'm. you supposed to do your little, uh, wipe me down with it. But he was like, he supposed to go like this. Oh, like what? bird, like you in your bird yeah. call. And then, so hey, I'm at the function. Up the cap, this the cap <laughs> 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 That nigga was a I'm, kappa. I'm, I'm with all my cousins and stuff. We in the basement. They playing a doggy. They like, nah, shit, why are you doing your dance like that? <laughs> <laughs> nah, my, my homeboy Kappa, he was just, he, this is how the Kappa. I think did. that's the worst I ever got trolled. Nah, okay, what, what you get trolled? I know you got trolled one time. You was hanging out with all the white people. They're king trollers. You was probably a troll. I was probably. I, I got no, a, he know. was a troll. Remember when he used to be like? Uh, no, nah, the first know. time I, I met Nate. The first time I met Nate, I hated the nigga. I know. I know. But he's like, look, look. Mom, ah! no, he said my mom. He was like, he, my mom's died. My mom's dead. 
Oh wait, no. He's the poor. Oh wait, wait, wait. I want to tell two stories, but the first time I met Nate. But one, I don't know if I can share. I don't know if I can share, but one, I can. The first time I met Nate, he was like, "This is a dude who's older than us." I guess his name was Marty. And like you know, you got that little kid brain. He was like, "Is it a black nigga?" Yeah, I guess. Yeah, he was like, "Say I look like him." Nate was like, "You like Marty?" And then I was like, "I was like, I thought he talking about Madagascar." So I said, I said, you like Alex the <laughs> Lion. <laughs> I ain't know the fuck they talking about. <laughs> you like, what? But then, like, so after that, I was mad. <laughs> and I think somebody was over there, like, one day he was hanging out in the gym class. And he was like, I think it was either him or this other white boy. They was like, I ain't know what Suicide Watch was. And they, <laughs> and they was like, it was like, it was like. It was like I was on Suicide Watch. And I was listening. And I was mad. I was like, I was like no, you wasn't. And then they was like, what? And then I was like, "What episode? What season was you on?" Because I thought it was a TV, like Suicide Watch, like a TV show. <laughs> so I'm pressing. I'm like, "What season was you what, on?" What channel was it on? <laughs> <laughs> you come from Rising. Me too. <laughs> what channel? Bruh, I didn't know what Suicide Watch was for a minute because there's a uh, there's a these are some old ass memories. I don't even remember. There's an odd future bro. song when the nigga was like, "Suicide Watch, nigga, kill yourself." And I every time I said that. Show, I be looking at my wrist. He's all his rolling up. <laughs> he turns to Big Bill. <laughs> 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 nigga be like, suicide watch. I be like, flexing my wrist. Like, yeah, yeah, like, yeah. Y'all see the suicide watch, nigga? <laughs> y'all see that like, I'm about to kill these niggas. Because remember the suicide doors. <laughs> yeah. So I was like, all right, so this is the suicide. <laughs> it's the suicide watch. <laughs> 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 Yeah. You had two watches all sometimes, right? That nigga had me heated, though. I ain't gonna lie. That nigga had me heated, man. That nigga had me heated. That nigga had me heated. Hey, but we good now. <laughs> that nigga oh, was a troll. But we good now. But oh, the worst you got troll, you saying your mom. Oh, shit. That's the worst. Yeah, that all the time. Just saying, like, let me try to think of some other shit. Well, this, there, then I was getting... Uh, did we th- were we just talking about um getting kicked off the uh, out the Xbox? Oh party? yeah yeah yeah. The nigga saying what what do you do to a soccer ball? I'm like oh you kick it thinking some some trivia shit. Niggas to kick me from the party and uh, niggas is laughing and I know they talking shit about me like oh you just got that nigga like I'm I'm 12 years old and nervous. You know who got kicked from the party and needed to stay kicked? <laughs> oh yeah, you the word. Oh, you just got to be Cyrus. Why kill Cyrus, man? He is. He was talking. Remember a year ago, he's he was talking about clown. he was on nobody the phone crying. Me. Nobody likes me. I was feeling Drake don't see. Bit too. You was. Mm-hmm. But then at the same time, I was, I was but like, I wasn't. Bro, you why, you owe all these people money. You keep putting bets on everybody. That's why nobody. You you, you in debt with all these niggas. So Drake? he falls off and he tries to find his way back to the top. But how does he do it? He tried to take Suki like down. Sexually assaulting <laughs> someone. That's exactly what happened. So Suki, if y'all don't know, if y'all ain't seen it, really honestly, it's been mad close to Suki recently. Where niggas been trying to flirt with her and stuff like that. Lil Duval did it the best way. If you see, you saw that jump. He was flirting with her. They was backstage, but he was doing that jump like that's out of everybody I seen recently. He was actually like pulling. Then she was on a podcast, and then this nigga was saying all this crazy stuff like, "Yeah, I do you crazy right now." And then, and then. Oh, then he show her the little jump. his meat pick. They was, she was talking about like she was talking about how five inches is enough, and then he showed her his meat. All right, why you, why you just... <laughs> Wait, I just showed you your Yeah, but it looked crazy <laughs> for the camera. Like, pause. My fault, bro. I just... And I'm looking, I'm like... I just saw <laughs> <laughs> it. Your tea had me... Anyway. Nah, but... I get it. We, it's, 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 a, it's, a, it's a story. It's a story. It's a story. Next. <laughs> so, so then... So then... Uh, the pot, Then... She's on the show next to Lil Duval. Walker outside is coming next to us. This talk. is for, the, for like the um big three joint, right? Nah, it's the I show where they be was. having the rappers. The but, joint. It's where they be having the rappers on it and they be hooping. Um, with like 21 Savage oh, be hooping, oh yeah, oh Chris yeah. Brown. Walker, I don't know, bro. I forgot about you. BSN anyway. or something like that. Something like that. Okay. Uh, So then she he rubbing her shoulders. Shorty like, ah, uh, laugh. She laughing. She the was actually laughing laugh. at first. It's and the uncomfortable then, shit. Then uh, he kissed her on the cheek at first and walks off. And then she kind of was like, oh, that's crazy. Ha, 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 ha. He came back. He started tonguing her down. No. She pushes her head away. No, but first he grabs her like under her chin like that. Do the whole grab shit. And like, and then it's like forcing himself on her. And she kind of like backing up. He geeking and shit. Like, you can, just, you can see Duval. And what it is with R&B Marco, niggas, man. Like, yo, what the hell going on right now? <laughs> What it is with R&B niggas? Yeah, they think they just... Because him, sing. Trey Songz, because I ain't going to lie. Oh, my God. The Trey Songz love, I never saw wild. no proof. And then I saw that video. You saw it? When he, he took said, her titty out. He said, titty, what did he say? Titty on the loose, titty on the <laughs> yeah, loose. Yeah, that nigga look lame as hell uh, on that video, bro. He look lame as hell. He like a white woman, too. So, bro, what do you think is going to happen? Yeah, that, She's yeah. not with it. <laughs> yeah. She's not. It's money. If you was a shorty, if you was a shorty and that happened to you, what's the first thing you think? I'm crying. 
I'm selling it. I'm crying. I'm doing. I'm, I'm doing yeah. It all. I'm doing the most. I'm actually <laughs> 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 getting that bag. <laughs> he just he just pulled my titty out. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I'm selling it. I'm looking it's at it over. like I'm like, dang, he shouldn't have done that to You're me. You're going to jail. But at the same time, he should have. I want my money. I'm calling my lawyer, Gerald. <laughs> and then and now she Shanti will be here tomorrow. Now she up, but. These R&B niggas be wildin', wildin though. Wildin', bro. Chris I, Brown, sometimes. I'm sorry. Chris we Brown. Got, I'm, I Chris hate Brown. to bring it up, Brown. but he's one of them. Chris Brown. Uh, but as far as wildin', well, Dang, so the R&B niggas are crazier than the rappers. Tank. Ain't, ain't he the one who's going outside? Tank. How Tank go outside? Uh, who, who is the one nigga? Tyrese. 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 I love it. Outside, I I, it's funny seeing him go outside. I can't lie. He <laughs> <laughs> be like, congratulations. <laughs> that was perfect. <laughs> <laughs> but the R&B niggas be crazy, man. Bro, I don't, I don't know what it is, bro. It's the R&B syndrome. Yeah, mm. and then you came out r and biz. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. That's that's what I that's how I put the remix on it because it's the rhythm and biz. It's not the rhythm and blues. But like, you don't be tweaking out. Nah, bro, I just be biz. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Yeah. But why Osiris, what should his verdict be? Everybody, people saying that since Suki be talking all this freaky stuff, that it's okay. Oh, hell no. They saying it's okay. Yeah, for I don't know. Nah, she didn't want it. Hell no. She, if she don't want it, then it's un. It's uh, what is it? What is it called? Unconsensual. Mm. He didn't he say, "Yo, can I kiss you?" There wasn't no. I'm sure there wasn't no pre-production saying that he was gonna kiss her, or else she wouldn't. Act that did like not that. Even, Yeah, exactly. He just walked on the stage. No, no, that was impulse at its finest. Like they, right but what him made him? What made him think that? Like he didn't pick up her vibe. That's what I was so but confused about. Didn't you see, so he was just able to walk on the stage just because he was a celebrity nigga. Yeah. Didn't you see the nigga that pulled up on Lil Duval? The little. I, can I be honest? I blocked that nigga on everything. That Way before that, gripped up, and then the big dude. <laughs> he took him to the ground. Took us to the ground. His ass cracked and <laughs> showing his shit. Yeah. And then the little nigga. Was like, what the fuck, bro? What the fuck? I'm like, yeah. nigga, you doing the most? That nigga's like. never been funny to me. I blocked him on TikTok a year ago. His, cause when he, like, what he does, he goes about that foreign dude who always walking up and trolling the like the celebrity. Dudes. He walk yeah. up and gets my ear. She's like, chupapi and my something like that. Yeah, Chichipinyano? man, uppercut, uppercut, oh, yeah, 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 uppercut, yeah, yeah. <laughs> uppercut, uppercut. I know. I would, I would have made that that video. I thought y'all viral. I thought y'all was talking about the one dude, the the like. I don't know if he's Spanish or what. He sounds European, but he got like the like kind of long black hair, and he just be nah, going up. He be going nah, up to celebrities and just like trolling them. Oh no, I like that dude. I like him. The little young it, kid. The young. It's the young girl. Yeah, little, yeah, like yeah, he like he like he went to speed. Popping. You know, like uh, yeah, he went. He gave, he gave him a, uh, a fucking messy shirt when he's like a huge Ronaldo fan. Oh he just him, shit like him. That. he gave eighty five nah, dollars. No. He's like, I got some for you, bro. The one, the one, <laughs> <laughs> the one we talking about is this short little Spanish I know dude. You talking about now? He just he be, be whispering in, in niggas' ears, bro. bro. He be in the grocery store with it. The thing that annoyed me though is that nobody really had put hands on him. Like I want them to. I want like like the bodyguard. That was the. I feel he like that's the highest. He still ain't. I, I know, but I feel, still ain't I feel get like it. that's the worst it's got, though. He still ain't get it. That bodyguard was supposed to grab him and put him in a Batista bomb. Bro, and some slam of these, him on that, his neck. Bro, some of these TikTok pranks getting out of hand, though, man. I saw this one. This dude was walking through, I mean, somewhere in the fucking grocery the, store. Uh, fucking oh. hood, bro. And he was just, he had a backpack, not on his back, not. He did He had a backpack, not on his back, not like on the front of him. He just like, he was holding the backpack. And then he was walking around with just his hand in the bag. And he walk up to somebody and just be like, Oh, yeah, I, I did see that shit too. See, and I'm, dudes were like, "Bro, you better stop playing like the show that shit." But yeah, real life, you seen people get shot. Die, yeah, they have died. I, I I'm say saying, let man. let them keep dying, bro. Yeah, that's natural selection. Let them keep dying. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's natural selection. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Natural yeah. selection. Natural selection. It, it's you your be time, that buddy. Niggas have already seen the results of some shit like that, and they're gonna do it themselves. You play stupid games. How far do you go to get viral? I'm not going far. Hell no. How far do you take? I go to the grocery store. Do you fight people on camera? Uh, fight people as in what? Like a fake fight? No, I'm saying like you like, like you run fight? up and you like act like you about to fight somebody. No, hell no. You That's asking corny. you asking for a fight? Like yeah, unless like, you really want to fight somebody. Okay, yeah. I guess. But like I'm you seen that, that one? Shit. There's one, but I've seen this. Uh, the thing is, it's like a trend though. How and it works. Will I whoop your ass. And it's a uh, Good this joke. a different dude I'm talking about. But it's a it's a trend and it works for some niggas and they keep doing it. It's this one nigga that kept coming down my page. The first time he went with a McDonald's shirt to a Burger King was like annoying everybody. And they was trying to kick him out and he got hoed by the worker. Damn. And the worker, like, this dude grabbed him by his Lift neck shirt. and oh. took him outside and forced him out. And all the comments was like, you got hold. So, like, he saw all the comments, so he spun back to the Burger King and just, like, stayed there and wouldn't leave. But my thing is, like, it's, it's, it's working oh, for him. Why, though? But since it's working for him, he's like, oh, I got to keep doing this. But it's like, I've never been in one of them situations, bro, but them situations look mad annoying. They do. When you on the, like, when you think about the other when side you're working. of it. Yeah. You're just trying to get in and get your money and get out. Yeah. Like, he did this one jump where he talks to this girl when she's waiting on her Uber. 
and he act like he bagged her. And then she runs to her Uber. He runs to the Uber, too. And he's like, oh, yeah, can you take me home with her? And the Uber don't know nothing. He new to the situation. And then she's like, I got to actually go. And he was holding the Uber up, holding the Joan up, like, really trying yeah, to I can't even watch shit like that because it gets too cringy and corny for me. To it's just, it's just me, it makes me mad because I be wanting somebody to get smacked. <laughs> it's crunchy It's dry It's, cr- it's crunchy It's real crunchy. dry out there But uh, really get off your crunchy. chest For me This is go out to all my little editor niggas man All my videographer niggas man uh, All your little editor niggas Yeah Your little el- editor niggas I said yeah Okay Y'all little niggas pay, pay attention Listen bro We gotta lock <laughs> in right now bro We gotta lock in right now Cause they coming Them, <laughs> them robots ain't playing bro in five years, them niggas taking our jobs, nigga. We gonna sound like they, the uh, the the Republicans and the immigrants in five years. They took our jobs. I done seen videos online of when they said to the uh, AI, "Draw me a picture of an apple." I think I'm about to get a little doodle. I'm getting Van Gogh. Uh, I'm getting Da Vinci. I'm getting the best artwork ever. That's and it's getting program. too crazy out there, bro. And it's just now starting. So I'm saying we either gotta learn how to find a way to be on the AI side. Or learn something new. Niggas gonna be plumbers in five years or some shit, bro. Because this shit crazy. It's actually disrespectful. If I'm being honest with you. Wow. And you y'all, is, and y'all, you, sound like, you is sounding like them Republicans, bro. Have you They're seen the, our jobs, bro? Have you seen the videos, <laughs> bro? They got this new thing for um, and I'm into here. They got this new jump for Adobe, Adobe AI. Literally, bro. If it's, they got you this jump, hot. they got this show on Photoshop. I can have a picture of you with just your chest and arm. Oh yeah, and then you do the whole I just thing. circle. I don't see and that. Add something. Joint. See, you know, I'm, you know, what I'm, being, I'm honest about. I'm mad that y'all have seen it, cause that means they're showing it to people who aren't editors too. So they letting y'all know I'm y'all can do, do it. I'm about to do it now. That's what pisses me off, bro. I'm That's how I get it. off my chest. I'm mad. I'm about to do it, and then I'm, and then we gonna put it on the pod so we can have AI work. work. Right, don't violate me. <laughs> <laughs> What's my get off your chest? Smarter work. My get off your chest is, oh yeah, man. Nothing but discussion. We just trying to take over the city, man. We trying to take over town. Anybody who wants to show love to us, we are open arms, and we want to show love back. So, um, it depends on what you are, who you are, though. It, 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 there is some politics towards this. Just, just new niggas, <laughs> new niggas. If we haven't tapped in with y'all and y'all are fucking with us and y'all genuine, we would love to converse and chop it up and just build together in the city, bro. Because you know what I'm saying. You got to take over your city, and why not do it together and uplift each other? All the cool kids in the cool kids club. Do that with each other, and then we just, you know, what I'm saying, get it done, and just be popping. Everybody like Atlanta. Yes, sir. <laughs> That's facts, though. The cool kids come up together, man. Yeah, for real. Everybody show love. Everybody come up together. Exactly. Nate, what's on? What's what's on your chest, Young Easy? I'm gonna keep it simple. Pressure 722. Hey, if you don't listen, you already know the deal. But <laughs> uh, you don't gotta if, say it no more. If you do listen, I appreciate you. Please share it. Please like it. Please share it with your friends, your mom, your dad, your auntie, your granny, all of them. There's music for everybody in there. Tell a friend to tell hey. a friend. And for one month, there's a new announcement. One for, month. for one whole month, from 722 to 822. If you want a feature, I ain't charging nobody. I'm paying for my own studio Free time. Ski. I'm knocking out all features. And trust me, bro, I be mad at myself sometimes because sometimes my feature verses be better than my own verses, bro. It's hard, bro. I think I think um, I get that. You should tap in with Mr. DOA. That nigga hard. Wait, no, that's not, why you pointed me? I was about to tell a joke. Uh, Dang. Yeah, me. I'm Mr. DOA. But I was about to tell a joke. But let's go. Let's do it, man. Let's hop, <laughs> let's hop, <laughs> hey, let's hop in the fridge, man. You ruined my damn, <laughs> ruined my damn joke. Hey, cool. and, <laughs> and one more thing. One more shout out for real. Shout out to you, these two dudes, man. I know <laughs> these guys for a long time. Biz, blah, you already blah, know the blah. deal. But, hey, seeing their journey coming up, man, they on their way. You know, if you ain't in that journey, again, you know the deal. What's but that you throwing up? VA. Uh, two up, two down. Yes, sir. Appreciate it. So you, stay, tap, stay tapped in with them. Boy. Stay tapped in Appreciate with me. You, boy. you know? Keep it's guarding all, your life. It's all love, bro. Oh, it's all love. All love. Hey, all love. And to everybody listening, if you made it this far, turn us up right now. Share on Spotify, Apple Podcasts. If you on YouTube, you know what it is, man. You know the vibes. We rocking out here, man. All summer, NBD Takeover, Big Content coming soon, Muck Bang coming soon, all that type of shit coming soon. This is episode 79. Bow, bow, we up this thing. Gang. Gang.